with a bit more starting collateral. Um, yeah, that's exactly right. First time when you're doing it, you just kind of have to build in the first prison on the list. You just kind of have to go with it and uh, just follow your heart. <laughs> Then you come into the conundrum where you just don't have enough space. Yards even getting a little too small. Long term investment should be paying out soon, so maybe at least wait until that comes through and then sell the prison. Start over. Building a high max maximum security death row actually does have a sense of appeal, a lot more challenge to it than doing minimum security. The cost, of course, is pretty high, but you make a lot of money off of your at max max risk prisoners. A lot of money, like twice of what a minimum risk guy gives you, if I recall. Yeah, I mean, I get three times the amount in payment. Delivered. Yeah. I think I can... I used, used to be able to see in the finance screen, like, mis, minimum risk, medium risk, maximum risk, and you could actually see the amount of money you're making off all your prisoners, different prisoners. Doesn't really seem like. I don't. Maybe I. Maybe I just like. Was dreaming that. Hmm. I just have trouble catching the chat when people send me messages in Twitch chat right away. Um, how much would I get? So let's see, how much do I get if I just... Theoretically, I can cancel these foundations and get the money back. That's a decent chunk of change. Well, that's most of it. Um... Now finance, we're going to validation. How much would I get? Your net profit would be 150. Because my current value is... $300,000. Go buy some of the shares. So let's see, actually, would it be better to buy the shares or just hang on to the collateral? Because the shares are going to cost me 30000 So I can buy one share, 10% more, which means that I would effectively get more. I'd be getting... Sixty percent of three hundred thousand. Okay, I need to break up the old calculator here. So three hundred three hundred thousand times sixty percent. I would basically be getting all right, so I'd basically be getting the money I am gave bought back back. I saw there is no gain to um buying my shares back, it would just be better to sell them off, as is. So we're going to do that. I might actually start large. No, I can always expand. 
So my funds, 150 grand. Whew, it's gonna be nice. Let's click play. All right, so I'm starting with 180 because I pause there. So, um, now update my title. Thanks, X Foolies, for following me. So, let's do this. We're going to do max sec death row style prison with this plan. Um, so, can I, I can't open the bureaucracy screen yet. So here's, should I just go, for, I might just go for, I'm going to go for the classic entrance. We're going to do a, I'm going to start by putting the war, the offices, right? No. That's going to be the security office. This is going to be the security room. Right here. And then I'm probably going to put... How big do I need to make reception? That's no requirement. The reception area. Nice big long room like this. And then I'm just spitballing crap right now, but it's gonna be the armory. Right here will be kennels. Yep, prepare for riots. That's gonna be the plan. <laughs> gonna. I mean, let's, so far what I've been doing, it's been fun, but uh, I want to actually create a bit more of a challenge. I always go for more minimum security just because it's easy to do. So here's going to be reception. That's going to be where they strip tease the prisoners down and uh, strip the prisoners down and search them. And then through here, I'm going to place the... Visitation. Uh, let's make this bigger. Cause I'm going for max size too. I think I did large. No, I did medium. Or did I? Yeah, that looks like medium. Um, so these are going to be my visitation tables. It's going to be kind of boring for you guys. I feel like to watch, so I do apologize. Um, I'll put some more visitation tables. I like that. That looks good. Um, security room followed by kennels followed by armory. Entryway right here. I think this should be secure enough. I always put my security and armory off of the main entryway. Following the logic that if the prisoners get into the entryway, they're going to break out rather than try to go through three more sets of doors and get at the guns. So far, this logic has not failed me. Uh, we'll see how that goes with these guys. Let's build some offices here. I think offices need to be 4 by. total. I can always kind of build more over here, I think. Actually, this is going to be the staff room. Um, and then I'm going to do the parole room over here, implying that these prisoners will be getting their parole. <laughs> um, that just basically needs that kind of table. I 
max security. Let's do this. Put another office right here, I think. Warden's office will probably be right there. So, building from this point, I think I'm going to put holding cells over here. Something along that line of size. And I might go for cell blocks up here and to here and put the workshops workshop right here maybe I might actually do the kitchen like right here right in the middle of everything so let's see I'll do a three wide walkway nice big old kitchen should be plenty of space for like kitchen stuff That should be enough for four ranges in the sink, as well as I'm gonna throw in because I did this last time and it turned out really well. Is throw in a little like X, the like cove over here, and they'll dump spare food into it, so it's like a pantry. It looked really well. It worked out really well for me. Uh, all right, so then I should be able to do probably eight by three. It's not a whole lot of tables. I'm not sure if I like this. 12 tables. I can make this bigger. I'll do this. I'll just go for like ultra long lunch lane. gonna cause me problems. I'm thinking it will. Let's cut this do about there. Um we're gonna move the kitchen up. Problems I big problems I had before where they would come in and it would just be there was no space. So I'm gonna build two entrances and there's gonna be plenty of space. Actually not even gonna put that there. We'll put a, like a kitchen alcove right there. That's gonna be where the pantry goes. Range one, range two. Range three and range four. And then sink can go like right here. Doorway out. We'll put two serving tables. I like that. I think, I think that looks good. I actually might even go so far as to just square it off here and put a cleaning cupboard right in there. Um, let's see here. What else am I missing here? Let's plan out our attempt at holding cell section. Let's do something probably about that big for the starter. Put a bed there, put a bed there, and put a bed there. Two beds next to each other. Bench will need to be there. And I need toilets. So what we're gonna do is we'll put a little wall 